It's only two years ago that the global community agreed on 17 sustainable development goals. The first goal sets the target to eradicate poverty in all its forms everywhere. The question is, how are we going to achieve that? Will we achieve it? What do we need to do? Economic growth, as we have seen in the past, it is essential for development to bring countries forward, but it is not enough to eradicate poverty because economic growth by in, its, in itself does not automatically trickle down to those at the bottom of the income distribution. Even though we have made a lot of progress over the past in terms of reducing poverty, nowadays there are close to 800 million people in the world that still live in extreme poverty. Now, social protection, what this chair is about, is an important ingredient and can actually help to achieve particularly the first goal and some other of the SDGs as well. What is social protection? Social protection are all public and private policies and programs which are aimed to support the poor and the vulnerable, are aimed to reduce risk, aimed to help people to sustain their livelihoods. Most countries in the world do have some kind of social protection policies. We have also seen that social protection policies can be very effective at different levels. It helps households to manage risks, it helps households to invest the human capital in livelihood activities in order to sustain a living. Social protection has been recognized as an important tool. It was only in 2011 that 183 countries agreed the recommend, on the recommendation to introduce social protection floors everywhere. Even though social protection is a human right, such policies are often seen as a cost to the economy, as if it is just a consumption and not really an investment in the future. However, we have shown that investments in social protection has long-term benefits which eventually exceeds its cost. If we would use business language, we would actually we see a positive rate of return in the future. Now, the establishment of this chair in social protection and development at Maastricht University is also a recognition of the importance of this topic. We are here, it is situated at the School of Governance, which is part of your new merit which means we benefit on the one hand from Maastricht University, but we are also embedded in United Nations University. This gives us hopefully also the floor to participate in a public debate, both at national and international level, and contribute to this target of eradicating poverty in the future.